Hello guys and welcome to DTWG the prep welcome okay so in today's video I'm going to be showing you um, you know what to study for the social studies test that's your GED social studies test and everything about it you know the time format um, the test format the number of questions everything about it, I'm going to be um, discussing this on this video it's quite a short video okay and uh, please if it's your first time on this channel please kindly click the subscribe button and the notification bell so you are instantly notified whenever we upload an educational video for you all right so because we do free videos on maths i'll be starting on science and social studies and your rla okay i'll be starting that very soon but there are a lot of resources you can get um uh, on maths here right now like I always refer um, to um, you know test uh, applicants for uh, to this video which is quite very good 30 most difficult GED math questions so it's going to help you out all right and there are other videos also so and also there's a Facebook group all right uh, which you can join to ask your questions any question math question science question you ask all right and uh, Definitely there will be responses from the community, over 2,500 members on the group, all right, that will to support you. And also one more thing, also I do one-on-one -on -one online tutoring. If you're interested, you can also send me a mail or chat me up on the Facebook group. I will leave the details in the video description box of this video. All right, so let's get on to everything about the social studies test so i put this up on uh, on our website where i uh, put a lot of resources there for you the dtwgdprep.com here you find several resources summaries on your science and social studies very soon i'll be uploading on the maths and also your rla all right so um how what to study for your the social studies test so we're going to this now okay so about the social studies test i'm going to just give you a brief uh, break down and um, you know take you through some other free resources that would help you out all right so the social studies test is about you know really for meaning in social studies is more of it's not a memorization test all right but you still need to learn some key terms like uh, you know your capitalism what socialism is you need to understand it that's why i've done all the summaries all right so it's more of reading for meaning almost close to your rla comprehension you understanding a passage or a graph a, a an image and okay analyzing historical events and arguments okay using numbers and graphs some math is in it also where you have uh you know your mean median your mode which you could use all right your test format the test format you have about uh, 46 to 53 questions uh sometimes the on-screen calculator will be provided where you need to do some maths it's made up of multi choices drag and drop fill in the blank and all the test duration is about 70 minutes that's one hour 10 minutes okay and uh, as i said it's not a memorization test so you don't really need to memorize stuff because everything will be explained in um the text the passage that is given to you and one tip I, I should i should also give to you is if you see i know there'll be questions where you have a lot of text like a passage to read them bring out your answer from you can just flag that for review like you skip it you, you flag for review you go to the next question that is quite shorter so you are fast okay so you're fast and then you come back to it all right so reading for meaning you have to determine the main ideas of um from the social studies readings you know um knowing the meaning of as i said common social studies vocabulary by god's grace i should do a video on vocabulary uh social studies vocabulary uh, vocabulary and terms and phrases like capitalism socialism communism what it means all right identifying how authors use their language to establish their point of view so it's more of comprehension and reading Oh, are you getting my point uh, analyzing historical events at least try to know some he, um, u.s history everything here on u.s history you can all get it from here all right you can see u.s history so know some of those all right then using as i said using uh, numbers graphs and social studies uh making sense of information you know it's more of the mass the data, data analysis analyzing information from maps tables photographs political cartoons uh interpreting creating graphs how to find the mean median mode and range from a data set you get my point recognizing uh difference between correlation and causation between events so these are all the things you need to know all right you need to study about them all right and um 
resources that will help you, Quizlet is a good that will help you in your social studies in you being able to comprehend a passage or whatever text it is. It's going to help you and definitely your GED.com is going to help you with different resources, your flashcards, practice questions and books that will help you. Kaplan will help you and this book stand, uh, Stack Vault Books from 2014 is also a good book that would help you all right sorry i'm a bit fast i just i don't know i didn't, don't want the video to be quite long because you know it's an informational video all right so um here if you need some more math videos i've just you know put them up here yeah this is a link to the facebook group also you can uh, you know click here to join the facebook group math 30 difficult questions and so on and so forth and if you did one-on-one -on -one online tutorial this is my email you can get through to me here all right so thank you thank you for staying tuned to the end of this video i'll be coming up with more videos to also you know inform you and assist you in getting your GED test uh, you see more of me uh, if you want real uh, uh, participation you need a community to support you join the facebook group it's a good one all right to support you all right you can join it here then i think that's all for this video now and before we move forward i just want to remind you that uh, jesus christ is coming soon give your life to christ for he's the way he's the truth and he's the life he's calling you all right he's calling you to take all your yokes your burdens you know if you're carrying so many you know that particular yoke on your body like a load a weight a weight on you he is willing to take that. Oh, you just you just need to call him and make him your personal Lord and Savior. And that's it. He's gonna he's gonna take everything from you and give you rest. That rest that passes all understanding, peace that passes all understanding, he's gonna give it to you. Alright? Whatever turbulence, whatever storm you are in right now in your life, he's gonna make everything at peace peace be still upon you and your household in jesus name amen all right thank you thank you for staying tuned to dtwgd prep don't forget that you are destined to win by god's grace thank you and see you in our next video